refocus the efforts of the other programs to support our research. STEM priority has seemingly overridden other departments' individual research. Chemical and botanical studies are focused now on temporary, priming subjects for their inevitable connection. Now that the prototype is up and running, experiments continue. Upon their return from STEM integration, patients are interviewed extensively. While their particular pathologies inform their experiences, there are commonalities. They all experience the same settings, the same occurrences. The world they inhabit becomes larger with every new visitor. This suggests that shards of each user's consciousness are left behind inside the stem, creating a community. It's as if internally a new world is being built. You're losing focus, kid. I warned you about that. How could this place exist? I don't understand. What's happening in here? Ruvik knows you're here. He's feeding off you. But there are more important problems. That detective. Joseph isn't something to worry about. He doesn't suspect anything. He's expendable. How else do you want me to say it? Remove him. That's an order. Hey, what are you doing? Killing Joseph? That's not gonna help me find Leslie. Oh, he can't be trusted. He'll turn on you. They all will, once they know what you're after. We told you. You're weak, kid. And you're disappointing us. Are you guys all right? We're all right. Sebastian, maybe we can lift this enough for Kidman to go under and open it from the other side. We're counting on you. It's odd, though. Why would they catch you instead of just killing you? Maybe he didn't see me as a threat. He? I know who you are. I'm not going to let you take him. You should have followed your orders, kid. Stupid Kidman! Ah! <laughs> 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 
I know all about you, kid. I know who you are. Kidman. gone far. <laughs> Their sins you are ashamed of. No, it can't be. Mother would sit in her chair, rocking back and forth, killing time until the next service. She barely spent any time with us. I wondered why she even had children at all. Miss Kidman, please tell me about your family. Next subject. No, 
We've prolonged this talk for a while now. It's important for our understanding of you. They never gave a shit. Too caught up in that church of theirs. More like a cult. It was like a punishment. Nothing I ever did was good enough for them. They abused you? No. It was more like neglect. That's why when I just left, they didn't care. They never came looking, they just gave up. And you never went back to them? I did. A couple of years later, they were gone. Everyone was gone. It was like the whole town got up and moved. I should have felt something, but I didn't. And how do you feel about it now? The same. They can rot for all I care. It was strange, though. There's a statue in the center of town, an angel with its head in its hands. I used to just stare at it when I was young, thinking it was sad. But now, I felt like even that statue knew how pitiful life was there. What a terrible place. stare up at the statue lit up in the center of town. It looked like it was crying for all the wasted life in that place. of my past. STEM must be creating this. constantly search for a place we feel safe, a home we can always come back to. We imagine that place in our minds and are drawn to it. You had a home, but now 
That place is here with us. Reuben has no idea what he's done. It's not surprising that he doesn't care, either. He was never motivated by fear of Mobius. The STEM prototype works, but only when connected to Reuben. I've checked the details, and he customized the whole system to only operate with his own brainwave pattern. I left him alone with the device for far too long. Trusted him too much, and despite all my knowledge in the field, it's past the point of fixing. I can't just flip a switch. And that's not the worst of it. They know, as well. I'm not going to take the blame for this. I will drag him here and make him fix it. I can't imagine what they will do to him if he doesn't. Please let it be Leslie. Ah! I've got to get to him before those things do. Leslie, it's all right. It's safe now. You can let me in. Safe? It's safe now?
He's here. Uh, finally found you. <sighs> You're not hurt, are you? <sighs> Getting stronger. Can't get away. We'll be fine, Leslie. Sure. Oh, my God, to get us out of here. Church, please. The church. Please, church. Church, 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 church. All right, church. come on. Church. Stay close to me. I'll protect you. Church. See, Leslie? We're almost there. Just a little further. Be kidding me. <laughs> Shit. Leslie, you've got to hide. Don't come out until I call you. I guess you could say I started young. I would sneak into the graveyard, steal the statues, and hide them. I wanted people to think they were cursed, but every morning they were back in their right place. Oh. I could survive on my own, I left and told myself I would never come back.
Come on, the church is right ahead. It should be a little safer. Than We should go. It's all right. I'm here. Nothing is going to get you. You have to stay with me. There's no other way. He's here! <clears throat> Ruvik, what do you want with me? You. I'm just making sure you're doing your job. Just like me, I doubt they want damaged goods. Back up! He's coming with me! Oh. I hope so. I needn't remind you the consequences for failure. Right. Your people aren't the only ones counting on this boy. You need him to get out. As do I. We're all their pawns, eventual victims. They killed me. They ripped me apart and took what they needed. I will destroy what they wish to control. Ruvik? Stop it! Let him go! He is my vessel. I am in control. I sense a conflict of interest. Just what was your mission exactly? Do you think their all prying eyes can't see in here? They've been watching you, kid. What are you doing, kid? You are to bring the boy back to us. No! I can't! If I bring Leslie out, Ruvik comes with him. We don't know what he's capable of. I... I can't let that happen. in a position to make decisions like this. This is not acceptable behavior. You will bring us back that boy. Run all you want, kid. You can't escape. Like everyone else that crosses us, we will hunt you down. Come back, kid. You have... 
have a job to do. Enough games. Stop running. Having all of you in one place will provide us with opportunities. I can't trust you! Not like this! No. She's... she's coming with us. She's my responsibility. Look, Seb, we need to talk. You're getting out of control. Finally, with this machine, I can go back. We can continue the experiments. There are some things here that are to remain in the dark. Beacon. I just hope I can get there before he does. A little hasty with that gun, kid. What is it you plan on doing? What I have to do.